think the first quarter and then fourth quarter we had a really good stretch over the defense. Mm -hmm. That's why I think uh, uh, we held down like how many was it? 106 or something? Mm -hmm. like, yeah, you know, um, those are defense like, you know, we need in the whole whole games, you know. Um, I think, but those are things like, you know, we I think we have a good offense. Uh, but, you know, defense is the one, the key, you know, we, either we're going to win the game or not. So I think uh, those are defense is the key. Wes has talked a lot about how he wants to get you guys in good habits, just like working hard, showing up every day. Have you noticed anything different about that this camp? Like, is he being more strict with either making you guys run or just harping on this stuff more? I mean, you know, we have a, uh, we have a, like a time slot that, you know, like we can shoot, like, you know, before it was like a kind of random, you know, like we can just show up before the, before the practice and like, you know, if you guys want to get shot, shots out, you know, you do it or not. And, but this time, you know, we have a, like a slot time. So like, you know, we kind of locked in, uh, practice before 15 minutes, like, you know, we, we, for 15 minutes, we just like, you know, do whatever we need to and uh, just get it ready for practice. So like, you know, we, we already in a good rhythm, you know, mm. once the practice starts. So it's, I think it's good. What do you hope to accomplish in the final preseason game? Um, you know, just like, we, I mean, we've got a couple guys get injured, so, you know, um, and then sick, so, you know, we, I don't know who's going to play or not, but I think we still trying to build the chemistry, you know, uh, around the team. Uh, so far, I think we're pretty good. Um, you know, last game we won, and this game against New York, you know, they're a good team too, so we just got to uh, focus on, like I say, defense, you know, that's, that's going to be the key, and, you know, just to build the chemistry. If if you and Daniel Gafford are the four and the five in the second unit, how do you think you guys can play off each other? You know, yeah, I I I, been, I played for I, I played with him for you know two years now, uh, so you know I know uh, what he's capable of doing. You know, so I just like you know, you know he's a good rebounder, of course, and the rim protector. So you know, we just got uh, me and four and the five. Like we can switch, you know. And four and a five, and like this defense guy. So I think those are good things, you know. Me and me, me and him on the court, you know, it's easy to switch it and just defense. Hey Roy, uh, KP said you're playing with a swagger this year. Uh, where's that uh, coming from? I'm um, just, I don't, I don't know. I mean, this is my fourth year, you know. Just the uh, I'm confidence, you know, I built on like this past three years, you know. Um, yeah, just like I got used to this, you know, NBA basketball and spacing and stuff and. What I'm like, you know, good at it or not. So just like I'm just showing the what I'm good at it right now, and just like trying to, you know, yeah. Just. And coach and some of the players talked about how competitive training camp has been. Just what are your takeaways from that? Yeah, just like a trying to be trying to show who I am, you know, team, and we have a you know a couple of new guys on the team too. So you know, it's just a little bit different the last year. So yeah, just trying to like I say, I've been saying like building the chemistry and. You know, learning each other every day, and yeah, we're just gonna see them other stuff in a week. So you know, I'm so excited for it. Really, I know before you took the time off last year, you'd been playing really year round. Did you get to take any time off this summer? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I had a lot of time, so you know, um, I got a lot of time for myself, and you know, spend time with my family, friends, and you know, um, going back in Japan and stuff. So yeah, it was a good time, and you know, walking out. You know, every day, you know, it was a good summer for sure. Do you feel the difference heading into this year? Do you, does your body feel any better? Yeah, I feel it for sure. I feel yeah. ready, uh, physically, mentally, you know, both both sides. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm ready for the season for sure. Uh, so you've gotten to play a little bit more with Kuzma on the court because of injuries and everything in the preseason. Do you like the fit with you guys? That's yeah, for sure, team? yeah. Me, me and the Kuz, three in the fold, you know. Um, you know, on defense, we can switch any any defense, uh, any guys, and, you know, offense, be, you know, I don't know, the other team, they, they won't know it's the food three and the four, and like, you know, we do like a mixing, like, you know, pop out, three, uh, pop, pop threes, and like, you know, uh, rolling and stuff. So, you know, it's a, it's a good, I think a good, it's a good um, lineup, you know, me and him on the same uh, same time. I think I like that, I like that a lot. All things being equal, do you like playing the four or the three? I mean, at this point, like, I don't know, it's just like, it's the same, like, you know, three and the four is the same now, so, you know, it just don't really matter. But, you know. What do you think will determine whether your guys' defense is successful this year? What do you mean? What, what, what factors, like, oh. what needs to happen for you guys to have as good of a defense as you hope to have? I mean, I think we just got to execute, you know, every game locked in, like, their first night, uh, the scouting, the polls, and, you know, just every team is different, so, you know, we just got to 
excuse, you know, who's who's a shooter, who's not a shooter. Um, you know what I'm saying? Those kind of stuff. I think those are key. To, you know, we have a lot of new guys, but they're like, you know, they've been here in the league for a while. So, you know, they know, they already know the personalities, you know, of the team. So I think this this year is going to be better for, for us to, like, you know, um, focus on, like, those personalities and, um, yeah, just play defense. Is that what was missing from the defense last year? Because obviously there was hope going into the year and it didn't quite go. No, for sure. My past three years, like, we have a lot of young guys, you know, like, we just don't, we just didn't know who's, who's like, you know. Uh, who does this and like you know, who's a right hand driver, a left hand driver? It's, I think it's really important, like you know, because it's this, this, this league, like you know, we we can't guard everything, you know. So we gotta, um, you know, just uh, eliminate like stuff that like you know they like to do, like you know those kind of stuff. And yeah, this year I think we can more lock in with those kind of stuff. For your individual defense, how much do you think that's going to improve just based on okay, you have a full training camp, you have a couple months from last season already under your belt, you know the system. Uh, first, I'm, I'm in a good condi condition right now, so you know, um, I think I can through whole games. You know, I can play through it, through whole games, and you know, do you know, anything, uh, offensively, defensively, uh, for sure. And yeah, just like I've been telling, like you know, people, it's just like I can go, I can go one to five. You know, I think so. Those are things like you know, I can help this team defensively. Um, yeah, just to get a rebound. It's looking like you're going into a contract year. Do you try and just put that to the side and not worry about it and let your basketball yeah. do talking? You know, you know, yeah, I love, I love this organization, you know, DC and stuff. Um, just like, but right now I'm just focused on, you know, this team to win and, you know, everything else comes out after, you know, so I'm very focused on this team and win. Going back to Japan, I guess, who do you think enjoyed the dinner that you organized the most? Everybody talked. Who, who do you? Out of your teammates, who do you think enjoyed the dinner the most? Oh, I think Denny. Yeah. <laughs> Denny was enjoying it. Yeah, he was asking me a lot of questions. Um, the food, sake, you know, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, he, he enjoyed it for sure. Yeah. Did they like your favorite dish with the raw egg? Yeah, they liked it actually, yeah. I was worried about it, but you know, <laughs> it's good, yeah. I gotta try it soon. Yeah, yeah it's good. How's camp been for me? Uh, pretty rough. I'll say that, um, I felt a little bit bad uh, for not playing the games in Japan and not practicing with the team for a long time. And, you know, sitting out and seeing all the guys having fun and building chemistry on the court. But I did the best I can to uh, come every day, talk to the guys, be be in practices, be aware of what's going on and what we, what we wanna, how we want to play this year. And I feel like I did a good job building chemistry even though I wasn't on the court. I uh, worked on my conditioning. I had some more time to work on my body in my game and uh, I think I'm ready to go. I understand you've gotten stronger. Uh, how do you think that can help you finishing around the rim? I think like uh, being, absorbing the contact better, uh, be aware like how to use my body and where. And uh, I think in the end of the day, I had good chances to make layups last year. It's just uh, the small amount of focus I need to, to actually put, this, uh, put the ball in the rim. And that's about it. I mean, the opportunities were, were there, but I um, think I'm going to do a better job this year of finishing for sure. What has been your focus kind of aside from the chemistry building part, just with the stuff you are able to do kind of off quarter in the weight room? Right I now? feel like shooting was a big part this summer. I worked a lot of my shooting and uh, it feels great. It feels like better than ever. And I have confidence in it. And, um, you know, I, I'm excited. I know it's going to take time to come and do it in, in game shape and game uh, conditions, but uh, I think in the end of the day, it will all come together and I'll, I'll, I'll shoot way better. I don't think we asked you, what was it like working with Drew Hanlon? Uh, Drew is, is great. I mean, his knowledge for basketball is, is amazing. He worked with some of the best uh, prospects in the world. And, you know, I wanted to be one of the, I want to be one of the best. So, you know, for to be one of the best, you got to train with also the best. And I feel like um, I trained in a high level, yeah. What's your uh, preferred offensive role on this team? Um, just create for my teammates, you know. I feel like I can handle the ball, create for my teammates, yeah, run on the open court, um, grab a lot of rebounds and, and help on the defensive end a lot like I did last year. And um, push it, push, push in transition. And as I said, I like to make my teammates feel good and I'll feel confident and that's what I'm, I'm gonna try to do, I'm gonna play hard. Do you feel comfortable being like a lead ball handler if that? If you needed to do the uh, if if that's if that's the position they want me to play and coach and the team uh, want me to play, it will be it'll be best for us. So yeah, I'm I'm comfortable with doing anything on the court. So, um, but I'm I embrace every role that I have. So.
Do you feel like you're health-wise ready for five on five? Uh, yeah, definitely. I'm ramping up. I think I, I need to credit uh, big time uh, the medical staff that was uh, carrying me around and then really did a great job of really uh, coming together and, and, and helping me figure it out. And without them, uh, it would probably take a longer time than what it is. So big credit to them. Have you had previous groin injuries in the past? No, um, no. As I remember, I didn't have. It's something that popped up this summer. You know, uh, I played on uh, I played on pills in the national team to kill the pain. And um, you know, in the end of the championship, I was like, I was I was barely walking. So I knew, like, coming into the season, it was kind of frustrated for me. Like after a good summer that I have, taking some. Uh, um, uh, back steps, but um, it is what it is. I'm here now. So, Danny, I know you took the injury you had at the end of your rookie year really hard. Also, yeah. do you feel like you're dealing with it any differently? Is it easier to mentality wise, or is it just bad for you still? I feel like uh, ment mentality wise, like I'm over it. I feel like that gave me like a warning sign that okay, I need to work on my body. You know, I need to be in shape all the time. I need to make make sure everything is right. You know, I'm doing my routine every morning coming in early and this is what it, what what's it, what is all about it's just getting stronger and be ready to play 164 games straight so Again, uh, this team seems really close uh, just what have you noticed so far about this team's camaraderie uh like chemistry wise mm -hmm. uh, i feel like there's a lot of group a lot of great group of guys around here you know we all feel like we all together we want to win that's the that's the most important and you know we got good vibes around the team and I think we got good chemistry. Uh, I'm hoping uh, this chemistry will last even when we have like, you know, better days and a little bit worse days. So I, like, I feel like we have a great group of guys who can do special things together. So I'm excited. And although you maybe haven't get to participate as much, what have you seen from the competitive side of this training camp so far? There, it's a it's a good competition, you know. I mean, uh, it's a good competition because they talking shit to me too on the baseline, you know. Even though, <laughs> even though I'm not in there, they'll be like, "Hey, Danny, when you coming back, we 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 going at you." So, <laughs> I, I like the competitive spirit, and I can't wait to be out there. What was it like, Danny, to be the guy or one of the prime guys for an entire country? I didn't lead a team for a long time. I didn't have that responsibility, but I guess. I guess it felt good to see that you still have it. You still have the the, the will in you to like be there and, and be responsible for game game winning shots and like crunch time shots and, and you know like that's stuff that I always love to do. So you know I, it was a good experience for me to do that there and practice on it and see that I still have it and I can't wait to bring it to the big league and hopefully have a chance to uh, do it one uh, one time and. and <laughs> is there any more pressure knowing that you're playing for your country than it is for your club team, for your pro team? I'm enjoying. Like you know, there's always going to be pressure. It's part of us, part part of our career. Like I think, I think guys that say that they don't have pressure on themselves, I don't think it's true. I think everybody got this sort of some sort of pressure, but it depends how you take it, the pressure. I, I mean, I, I enjoy it. I embrace it. It's fun. It's challenging for me. I like challenges. So. Um, you know, it's 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 good for me. It's giving me it, it gives me motivation to keep building and be be better. Are you gonna keep the highlights for the season? Uh, people say uh, teammates around the, the team say I should, but uh, we'll see. Depends on my mood. Which teammates? Like <laughs> I mean, no, nah, Kuz didn't really. No, nah, Kuz. I think Kuz was cool with it. Yeah, yeah Kuz was cool with it. I was like, I was like, why why didn't you die yours? And he was like, nah, I want to keep I want to keep it simple. <laughs> so we'll see what I'll do.